Hi, I'm Randy Vance. I am at the ICAST show in Orlando, Florida. This is the 2021 show. All of the greatest and the latest fishing tackle, boating equipment in the world is going to be down this escalator. We're gonna walk through it and I'm gonna show you the cool stuff, but first, a show like this has to have a pretty thick and hefty guide, so we need this. Follow me. This is the Atlas Backpack. On the top, you've got a magnetic tool holder, and I mean, when you get your tools stuck on there, you're not gonna get them off without trying. Fishermen are all about the wiggle and the spin. This is Z-Man's new Hercules, and it's got plenty of wiggle. I love this new tail here. Now there's a lot of cool design features here. First of all, they have what they call float technology. We're at a spot in marine electronics where the technology has gotten so good. One of the best things coming along is new software, firmware, and especially mapping. Ray Marine has just introduced this new lighthouse map system. We're looking at the base map right now that is embedded in your Raymarine machine when you buy it. Here's another one that caught my eye, and keep in mind, in this theme of fishing tackle, it's gotta catch the fisherman first. This is the Rage Punch Bug. Now, Kevin Van Dam invented it, and he did so because he wanted something that would really hold a large hook. Now, Yellow Tech is expanding their product line to include this great light. The guys will hook this up sometimes and it gives them enough light to run the boat by. Right now, I happen to be in my favorite booth at the show because I've got a great leather armchair here that gets me off my feet. I'm with the folks at Costa Del Mar who have just come out with a new series of sunglasses called Untangled. What they've done is remarkable. They've created a pair of sunglasses completely of recycled material. I like the fact that you can lift the rod in and out very easily, but for bottom fishing, you can tilt it down more so that you get a little bit better play on the rod when there's a bite. Now this is a cool grill. I'm at the Hitchfire booth, and Hitchfire has come out with a brand new gas grill to utilize your trailer hitch when you don't need to trailer your boat. Now you know, the most efficient fishermen in the world really aren't men at all, they're sharks. The problem with sharks is they get smart. When you start getting fish on, they're gonna come after them. It's an easy meal. Well, Shark Band's Zeppelin is designed to repel the shark using an electromagnetic force. I'm in the Oz by Scentlock booth right now, and they have developed a brand new cleaning device that is ozone charged. Now, Oz has a long track record of providing ozone cleaning equipment like these gas chargers here. You can put them in small compartments in your boat. It'll kill mildew, it'll kill bacteria, and it'll stop the smell in there. I'm with the folks at GP Link. This is a satellite-based, app-based system that will help you keep track of where your boat is exactly. Now, there's more to this story than just the shape and color. Now there is 10 colors, by the way. But look at this lure here. Stainless steel hooks, 
You've also got all stainless steel hardware, including the shaft that runs through it. Best of show is the Berkeley Power Bait Gilling. This is the bait here. Look at this thing. You can see that it's Texas rig here, but from side to side. What I like about it, of course, it's power bait impregnated, so it's putting off the smell and, and attractiveness of bait fish, but the shape of it. With the guys here at Shimano, they just came out with this new sustain reel. It's an upgraded version of the established model, and it's got some really cool features on it. The first thing you're gonna notice when you pick it up is A, how light and well balanced it is, and how ultra smooth it is. Here's our first bait, and it's got a little propeller on it that spins. Jerk it, makes a nice splashing so noise, and they say the propeller attracts fish. In my experience, usually it does. I'm in the St. Croix booth right now, and they have just introduced an entirely new line of surf rods. They're called Siege, and they've got some great features on board. I'm holding this one here, and I want to show you something unusual about it. It's got about a 60-40 difference between the length and the halves. Now, the reason they did that is because their anglers like to use that for a walking stick when they're wading out in deep, rocky water. found a real problem solver here. You know how when your cooler is sitting on the ground, you're either sitting on it or you're setting things on it. And then when you go to get a drink, all that stuff goes on the ground. Well, Overboard has created a table that mounts firmly to the top of your cooler. The hardest work your reel is going to perform is flipping the bale releasing the bale, and initiating that first crank. This is going through 100,000 of those cycles to prove the reliability of this bale system. And I gotta tell you, it's very impressive.